Hello guys, it's Reed here once again and it's time for another exciting product review. Now today we are reviewing the LG G4, the brand new phone. It doesn't even come out until June. And uh, I'm very, I cannot believe LG would even think of sending me this phone to review. A beautiful display, 5.5 inches. Uh, it's 1440 by 2560 display. And it's flat out beautiful. Now, 5.5 inch screen, it, it may be too big for women out there, but to me, I could even handle like a 6, 6.5 inch screen. I think that's fine with me. It's a beautiful screen. It's one of the most beautiful things I've ever seen in my life besides my ex-wife. I mean, other than that, this screen is absolutely stunning. Uh, I play with this phone about, let's say about two to three days now. Got it Thursday. Today is Monday. And uh, I played with it, you know, off and on. And I've got about maybe eight to 10 hours of battery life out of it. And that's by searching a lot of the uh, plant. I've been using it a lot for YouTube. A lot of YouTube videos. I watched the ESPN app on it a little bit. What I've been watching a lot of video with it. That's usually what I do with my tablets and my smartphones. More than anything, I watch video on them. And I've got about eight to 10 hours. And I consider that very good considering what I'm doing. The phone does get a little bit warm when you're uh, watching video with it. The back of it and the screen gets a little bit warm, but it's nothing like it's super hot or nothing like that. You can handle it very easily. Uh, the volume buttons are here. There's also, you know, the controls on the front where you can adjust it, but right there is an up and down volume. Listen to that. You can hear it go up and down there. And there's your on and off for the screen. Turn it off and turn it on right there. And in the back of it also, you have a 32 gig SD card you can put in there. I think you can put up to a 32 gig. It may be more, but I know it comes with 32 gigs internal. And everything's fast about it, people. Surfing the web on it's fast. Uh, looking up, I was looking up videos, they would load fast. On the Wi-Fi, they load fast. Uh, it's just great. All I can pretty much say about it, people, is uh, the only downfall I've got for it, I guess, would be that it's plastic and there's no wireless charging yet with it. But other than that, it's almost the perfect phone. Just like my ex-wife, this is the kind of phone you're going to play with all day. Never going to get tired of it. You're going to just play with it all day. Just like a hot, young, petite Asian girl. You're going to get done playing with it, and about five minutes, ten minutes later after you recover, you're going to want to play with this phone even more. I mean, you're going to just play with it all day and all night and never get tired of it. Until probably the six months or a year later when you'll see something newer and hotter. It's kind of what I see with the G4. I dropped this phone now on carpet, luckily, about an hour after I was playing with it. I dropped it on the floor. It's very slick. It needs a case. You have to order a case off Amazon right now. There's not any available for it. But luckily I dropped it on carpet and I've got close to dropping it two or three times since then just because uh, the grip is it's so th it's so easy just to drop it really is thumbnail it's almost the perfect smartphone almost perfect it does have a few flaws you know slick plastic and it's got that curve that's not a flaw that curve is a beautiful thing Oh yeah, let's talk about picture quality a little bit. Uh, pictures are very good, and video quality is also great. It shoots 4K video. I was messing around with that. Uh, pictures look very good. Of course, it's nothing like a good quality camera is going to give you, but still, very, very good. You know, it's it's just almost the perfect phone. It's almost perfect. I can't imagine it getting much better than this. I really can't. Battery life could be better, of course, I would say. But I don't think most people watch, um, you know, video after video like I do with, with your uh, smartphone. But anyway, I'm going to give it a four and a half out of five. I highly recommend this, people. It truly is just an amazing little smartphone. Coming out in June, and I think it's going to be uh, $199, if I'm not mistaken. It's going to be $199 with a contract or $600 if you buy it straight out. So there it is, guys. I want to thank LG again. Thanks, guys, for uh, for the phone. I, I appreciate it. I really do. So that's the official review, guys. And I want to thank you for your support. You all made this possible also for me to even, you know, just imagine getting a free phone like this in the mail. You know, I'm not just saying it's great to, because I got it free. It is a great phone, and I was actually looking, looking to get it kind of even before 
the video camera. Even before I even before I got offered to get it for free, I was thinking about it. I might get that. So as always, like, subscribe, and comment. And I'll see you guys next time with another exciting product review. Have a great day, guys, and thanks for watching. I appreciate it.